five, four, command engine start, two, one, ignition. <laughs> Go. Mission Control has confirmed New Shepard has cleared the tower on her way to space from Launch Site 1 in the West Texas desert with Mannequin Skywalker on board. Right about now, the fins on the aft portion of the vehicle are going to start help the vehicle do its roll maneuver. The booster is going to be rolling at about 2 to 3 degrees per second, which equates to a full rotation of the vehicle every 2 to 3 minutes. This, of course, is to give the astronauts a 360-degree view during the flight. All right, coming up here on max Q, maximum dynamic pressure on the rocket. It's the toughest part of the portion, toughest portion of the of the flight for the rocket. And we've confirmed max Q. Excellent. All right, you can see on the top right side of your screen, that's where you can follow along as we're gaining speed as she climbs up towards space. In the bottom left corner is the altimeter, noted in, in, in feet above ground level, although you may have noticed upon, uh, at liftoff, we were sitting at 3,700 feet above mean sea level. That's the altitude uh, of our West Texas launch site. Uh, now, Mannequin Skywalker in there, starting to feel those Gs, around three and a half Gs on the way up to space. It's very similar to a roller coaster, but in that horizontal position of the seats, definitely is a much more comfortable ride. Engine restart. Touchdown! Welcome back, New Shepard. Oh, you can hear our team back here at headquarters enjoying our, this moment for this rocket. What a day! Did a nice little maneuver. Uh, you know, Mannequin Skywalker. I mean, <laughs> if he had adrenaline, <laughs> his heart would be would be thumping pretty hard. What a day! All the way up over the Carmen line and back, coming in for a nice soft cruise back into our 